Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. And uh, today I got something a little bit different for you guys. I'm going to show you how to access the beta and PTRs. So you got to go into your Steam and your libraries. Click on the game, right click it, go to properties and betas. Here you'll see all the different versions of the game, including old versions, modded versions, and the new PTR. If you want to use mods, you definitely have to click on the moddable version. And it's that simple. And with that, now you have access to all the mods in the game and that's just the mods that are accessible through the Steam Workshop which include rims and different bodies for the cars so you can have cars that are not in the game in the game. And a lot of them are detailed, some aren't, some are just the plain old body but it's pretty cool because now you can have your dream vehicle in the game. So the first thing we're going to do is click these couple of dots right here and click on workshop and that is how you access the steam workshop for the mods that are allowed in the game so each mod is associated with the base car that's in the game sometimes there's not a thumbnail but if you click on it there might be pictures of the mod in there but what's really important is that when you click on the car that you want to download you look at what it goes to that way you know how to access it in the game and all you do is simply click on subscribe and that puts it right into the game. So as you can see here, we are now in Car X on the moddable version and we're going to scroll down so we get to the GT86 BRZ Scion FRS thingy majig. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and uh, yeah, you're going to click on body kits and it's going to scroll all the way over to the right. And those white little thumbnails are the modded cars. So we're going to click on that and there you have it we have our prius now there these mods also include cool little details to them so like this one has removable hoods different exhaust pipes we even got some bozo pipes going on and uh these things look absolutely sick yeah we're definitely going to use the uh, double stars but yeah there's also modded rims and the modded rims used to be universal some of the the mods do work to be universal but from what I've noticed in the last couple of updates, it's by the card that you download. So let's say we downloaded three different mods for the Sora. Well, those three different mods have different wheels on them. And then those wheels you can use between different models on that one car. So we're going to put some hot boy wheels on this thing. And yeah, you know what? We're going to sand this thing and make it look crazy as hell. And then we'll drive it in the game. So uh, let's do that. All right, so as you can see, it drives like any normal car in the game. Uh, it's obviously not set up for the wheel, and uh, yeah, we just wrecked this thing. But yeah, guys, it's that simple. If you guys have any questions or want any more details on other things like how to install Kino or ZML like I'm using right here for the thumbnail, and uh, I can definitely show you guys how to do it. It's pretty simple as well. But uh, I decided that this video is your foot into the door of modding car x and it's very very simple um yeah and accessing the betas and ptrs like that gets everyone in the community included so we can help make this game better for the devs and testing it out but if you guys have any more questions leave a comment below like and subscribe and i'll catch you on the next one see you everybody